What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video, man. So today we are reacting to poolside Karen harassing black family gets fired. And if you hear a lot of wind, that's my air. I'm not turning that shit off. It's too hot, bro. It's 106 degrees right now. The sun is shining. But I'm trying. You know I'm doing it. I'm out here. You feel me? But let's get right into this video. In three, two, one. I do, and I feel it's discrimination. This is poolside Karen. My, poolside Karen. It is discrimination. I have a room here, and I told her that. And and I told no. And let me explain my side to you. She called you officer, and she called you here. So y'all both here harassing me. Why have my children? Why have my children in the pool? <laughs> it was other people in the pool. She said nothing to them. Okay, my room. Where's my proof? This is my proof. Okay, this is my proof of the Hampton Inn. So I don't. Why do I have? To, Wait, nigga, you come into the pool harassing me that I don't have a room? Why would I not have? I'm gonna just be swimming in the pool, nigga. You think because I'm black and I'm in a nice neighborhood, I can't get a room with my kids and have. Man, what the fuck? To tell you what room I'm in. What did I do wrong? This lady here is discriminating me. That is not true. That is not true. You asked me. What I don't have to tell you, I have a key to get it and I can show you that it worked. Why do you need to know what room I'm in? I have a room here. I don't need to get my name. I didn't break the law. I don't I don't have to I don't have to give my name. No, I do not. <laughs> I don't have to give my name. I don't have she to don't. give my identity. I did not break the law. I know the law. You didn't say anything to the man and the lady. You said nothing. You said nothing to them. So I'm here with my kids on a, on business. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. In Williams. She said on business. On business. She said, I was here with my kids on business. <laughs> it's in North Carolina. I'm here on business. So they're running my license plate. This officer here told the other officer to run my license plate. So because we're, I'm the only black person here, in this pool, they want to question me. Harassing guests of the hotel and calling the cops. According to The Root, Anita Williams Wright had to prove she actually rented a room. And she goes on to explain, there were two Caucasian people at the pool who were not questioned, and that the employee said to me, oh, because it's always people like you using the pool unauthorized, who is people like me, she said in the video. So basically, I guess people be jumping over the fences and shit trying to you know get in the pool you know because it's hot as fuck outside right now so what you expect but it's no right to discriminate somebody you know what i mean like that's fucked up and they know the shit that's going on right now they thought they weren't gonna be put on blast you thought she wasn't gonna get on her camera and it sounds like she like important because she like i know the law and man like they be doing they be doing people wrong they don't they don't even know who they doing wrong like if that makes sense if that makes sense it makes sense to me the employee seen here according to usa today has been fired the statement was also printed by the outlet hampton by hilton has zero tolerance for racism or discrimination of any kind <laughs> on saturday we were alerted to an online video of a guest incident at one of our franchise properties the team member is no longer employed at the hotel hey. i feel it's discrimination i have a room williams wright said in the video while holding up her room key this lady here is discriminating against me i have a key to get in and i could show you that it works I have a room here. I don't have to give my name. I didn't break the law. I'm here with my kids on business. She yeah, went on to say on she business. continues to hold up the key in the video. This is not the first and it won't be the last time that these sort of incidents occur across America. The fallout continues from an alleged racist incident at a port. Bro, I like how his, his background is like so just... It just blends in, like it just looks normal. I don't know, it just goes together, bro. That's an amazing background. But if y'all enjoyed this video, man, please like, comment, and subscribe. I truly appreciate it. And like I said, all lives can't, like, all lives can't matter until black lives matter, bro, period. I'm sorry. Cause we out here getting brutalized, be discriminated against, as you saw. So, fuck out of here with all that all lives matter shit, bro can't matter until my life matters until my brother life matters you know yeah peace out